The South Dallas Fair Park community is still a community that is uh, challenged. It has a very high poverty rate. Most of the residents make less than $15,000 uh, annual income. Dilapidated buildings. It is a community in crisis, a community in despair, because it is in an impoverished neighborhood. Statistics have said 96% of the children are coming from a single family home. 56% of grandparents are raising at least one of their grandchildren. Um, and so it is a community that has struggles. Uh, what we've decided to do is to look at those challenges and needs in the community to see how we as a church in the neighborhood could address those needs so that we would have a sense of relevancy to our community other than just coming on Sunday morning to worship, but really meeting the needs of those and our neighbors to be able to share God's love with many who feel hopeless. Cornerstone uh, came into existence in 1986. We are about a four minute drive from City Hall. I got connected to Cornerstone Baptist Church. One day I was walking through the Student Center at Dallas Theological Seminary and saw an opportunity uh, on the Student Ministry Board to work in an inner city church for a summer. And um, so I thought I would apply to do kind of that internship. And um, 30 years later, I'm still here. Of course, my name is Chris Simmons. Chris Simmons is a guy who just grew up in Washington, D.C. in a family with uh, one brother, one sister. But my mother had a heart and passion to help others, and so she raised literally hundreds of foster children. And so my biological parents um, were very instrumental in helping other kids have a wonderful life. Over the years, we have done a lot of relief ministries uh, that reach out to the needs and meeting immediate needs of individuals for food. We provide about 10,000 meals each month for those who are homeless and indigent. and we see about 1,000 unduplicated individuals through our clothing closet. I believe that there is hope for the community and part of our mission as a church is to really work to bring about hope in an oftentimes viewed as hopeless situation. The clothing closet and showers provide a place for individuals to receive clothing but also have a place to come get cleaned up. We provide a medical clinic for those who cannot afford to go to see the doctor or don't have medical care, dental services for individuals who might be in pain because of infected teeth, for after school care, for educational needs. One of the things that we want to do over the next five, ten years is really step up community development. We want to see business opportunities come into the neighborhood. We would like to see some new homes um, developed in the community because we want this South Dallas Fair Park community that is oftentimes forgotten to become a place that many individuals feel it is a wonderful place to live, to work, and to play. Thank you so very much. We certainly are able to do what we do because of faithful partners and supporters. Uh, they can view us online at www.cornerstonedallas.org. Again, corner stonedallas.org and that will give them information regarding ways in which they might partner with us in this neighborhood. Um, one way is uh, by giving donations of food, of clothing, financial support is always needed. Another way of volunteering, of giving up their time to come down and to actually serve in the various ministries or opportunities, the clothes closet, food pantry, uh, working with teenage pregnant moms, 
Um, another way is just providing professional services. Maybe they're an accountant or have some kind of skill that they would like to bring to bear to help a community become a better place. And so really, if they would follow us on cornerstonedallas.org, it will give them more information regarding our outreach.